since doing the live that I did yesterday about three things to avoid when ventilating, I have been inundated with questions about ventilating from all platforms. So tonight I am going to be going deeper and taking your specific questions about ventilating. I'll see you back here in just a second. To help you start making deposits yeah. We building a team full of winners from novice beginners to moguls with profits And moguls that's profits yeah. Steady for greatness we strive yeah. We dropping them gems over here yeah. Tune yeah. into my quarter we live yeah. All right, I am so excited because Thursday is kind of like our Friday, but this is the last time that we will be live until the first week in December. We're taking next week off, but I'm starting tomorrow. But listen, I cannot believe right now it is November 18th, which means this is the absolute last day that anybody can enroll in Lace Wig university this thing has been a long time coming i'm so excited you can just go to lacewiguniversity.com to enroll but real quick before i get into your questions and be sure to drop those questions in the chat i'm going to go over everything you get when you enroll right now in lacewig university all right so first and foremost as soon as you enroll you get instant access into the lacewig training system all right the system is comprised of 16 modules Everything taught by me step by step to teach you everything you need to know about my approach to making wigs. It is absolutely amazing. I took a step back from my previous system during quarantine last year and I went back to the drawing board, started from scratch, refilmed the entire thing. On July 22nd, we turned on the cameras and when we shut those cameras off, we went directly into editing mode and right into launch mode. And here we are. And I can't even believe, I mean, we started in July. Here it is, November, and it's ending. It has been a crazy couple of months, but I'm so excited. So after phase one, which is the Lace Week Training System Unlocks, and listen, I've simplified the process even more. And that's what you're going to see inside the Lace Week training system. Some techniques that I've changed, but most importantly, a simplified process. And I'm so excited from all the brand new students, literally from all over the world. This is so incredibly exciting. And I cannot wait to see what everybody creates. I'm already getting um dms and all kinds of things with pictures of work and it's so much that i haven't even had time to sort through and start posting to social media so i'm really excited about that now phase two phase two is the lace wig mentorship program so not only are you learning how to make lace wigs but we're going to make your first piece together then i'm going to teach you how to market your services and then you're going to learn the importance of having the right mindset and eliminating all the head trash. Cause let me, I can have an entire live just on head trash alone and the things we think and how the things that we think become self-fulfilling prophecy. So it's very important that you have the proper mindset. And then in the middle of all of that, we have a live private live virtual mentorship meetings meeting where you get to ask me, all the questions you want to ask, and I will sit there for however many hours it takes and answer your questions. All right. That is phase two. Phase three unlocks and phase three is all about the bonuses. All right. I flew instructors in from all over the world to teach different strategies and techniques 
for wig making. Now, there's two brand new bonuses that I've never launched before. One is wig maintenance and styling by the most amazing stylist. One of the most amazing stylists I know, his name's Rob Fuchs, and he is an amazingly talented stylist. And then, of course, sewing machine wigs made easy. I'm so excited about it. I'm gonna be teaching you how to make a wig on a sewing machine the easy way <laughs> with four different machines, three different types of traditional machines and then the industrial machine as well. And then last but not least in phase four, that is when your certificate, um, it will be available after you pass the test. You have to pass the test first, and then you'll be able to download the seal to put on your website to let everybody know that you are a Lacewig University graduate. All right. The important thing to remember, there's two things. And then, of course, we have a graduation party. All right. We have a graduation party at the very end. And then I sneak some bonus virtual lives in there as well. So stuff that you're going to have stuff available to you that you don't even like that's not even advertised that I haven't even talked about yet. Okay. Just go right here to enroll at laceweekuniversity.com. You have two payment options. One, you can make one full payment of $3.95, or you can break the payments up into four payments of $99. And guess what? It ends tonight at midnight. So you do not want to miss this. All right. I don't know when I'm going to open up enrollment again. I'm going all in with my students. I mean that like all in, I'm going all in and it's going to be amazing. And I'm super duper duper excited. Now I will say this, let me say this. Um, I will bring it back sometime next year, but I just don't know when I don't know specific dates. I don't know timeframes. The last time it was 18 months since I launched anything having to do with lace wig, uh, lace wigs at this level. All right. So I'm already, I already have speaking engagements lined up for next year. So I don't know yet when it, this is going to fall into place. So I don't want you to wait. You have until midnight, get in where you fit in. If you haven't already. All right. Go right here to laceweekuniversity.com. All right. And then after you do that, write this statement right here down. I love this t-shirt. I was at Target the other day. I said, you know what? I love it. I got this. Sometimes you got to encourage yourself, <laughs> right? Jessica, congratulations. Hey, I just enrolled. Them extra days was a blessing. <laughs> Thank you. You are so welcome. Marianne Day says up at 4 a.m. in Florence, Italy for this live. Wow. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you for staying up with us or for getting up early. Annetta. Hey, hey, how are you? Ivy, how are you? Uh, Rhonda Thornton. You don't miss a live. I love it. Hello. Hey, Tiffany. Hi, everyone. Kim Wallace. How are you? Yep. How you doing? <laughs> D, D U. It looks like D U. How are you? Uh, Shireen. Uh, let's get this. Oh, okay. I guess you were tagging somebody. Let's get this. Uh, there you go right there. Just go to laceweekuniversity.com to enroll. I am so excited. Let's get into some of these questions. So just like always, you may see me looking here. You might see me looking up there and you might see me looking up here. All right. I don't have my um, two other cameras on today. So just know that when you see me looking anywhere other than right here, it's because I'm reading something. Tatiana. Hey, Tatiana. How are you? How are you? Kay Cook, hello. Lauren H, hello, hello, hello. Uh, Tiffany says, I love that you go live at this time because the baby is asleep and I can focus. You know what? I've gone back and forth about thinking about changing the time for the live because I know it's 10 o'clock on the East Coast, um, but it's 7 o'clock here on the West Coast. So I don't know if I'm going to stay at this time, but I personally like this time of the night. Uh, I believe Proverbs 31, 26 is about you. You're a gift to mankind. Man, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. Thank you so much. I need to, I don't want to forget that verse. When I go for my Bible studies, I'm going to make sure that I study that verse. Proverbs, uh, what was it? 31 and 26. Got it. Boom. 
Uh, I got this. You got this. We got this. Yes, Nina. That's right. We all got this. Uh, I am Letitia from Maryland. Hey, how are you? Emma, Emma Ra. Hello. Hello. Hello, AJ. Hey, AJ, how are you? It's so good to see you on here again. Just go to lacewiguniversity.com to enroll. There's, it's almost gone. All right. It's almost ending. Uh, it's going to end at midnight. Today, I got at least four videos. Yes, I got at least four videos from the lace wig system. I love it. I love it. I love it. Monica, you are amazing. Keep pressing forward. Look, you got this. I got this. Y'all write that down. I, I, I'm for real. Write it down. Remember this day. I got this. Tiffany, how are you? How you doing, Tiffany? Paige, it's good to see you on here again, Paige. Tisha, hey, Tisha, how are you? All right, let's get into some of these questions. So like I said, after last night's live, I was inundated with questions about ventilating. Some people, the first one that I want to address is the terminology. Because somebody asked me um, the other, uh, probably maybe... I think it was earlier, earlier yesterday before I, when I posted that I was going to be doing yesterday's live, they were asking me something about the terminology. Is it called um, ventilating? Or is it called hair ventilation or lace ventilation? They were trying to figure out the proper terminology. So let me say this, depending on where you're located in the world, the terms may be a little bit different. So over in Europe, Instead of using the term ventilating, they use the term knotting. So they also don't call it a ventilating needle. They call it a knotting hook. All right. But in, if you're in the U.S., we call it ventilating. All right. The, the term hair ventilation, I just started hearing. Um, normally, the way it's been over the last, I don't know how many years, is just ventilating. All right. You ventilate a lace wig with hair. OK, so that's I wanted to make sure I didn't forget to answer that question because uh, I that question is something that I keep hearing a lot. All right. Sybil says, hi, my quite a nice to see you again. I'm ventilating with a rubber fingertip on my thumb and I don't need a bowl of water. Thank you for the idea with water. There you go. Yes, you can use those rubber tips um, for me personally. And a lot of people like the feel of those rubber tips. I just don't like the feel of anything other than my fingers is I'm just a little bit different like that, but they do work because they add a little bit of stability and sticky is not the right word that I'm looking for, but it does add more stability that you don't get when you don't use like a, a rubber glove or, or a rubber fingertip or water or something like that to stabilize the hair. Okay. Uh, all right. Moving right along. Thank you for my birthday text. You are so welcome. You are welcome. I'm grateful for your response to your community. Thank you so much. You know, I, I was in there today. I try to go in there every single day and answer um, texts and texts back and forth. Um, as I said before, sometimes I don't get a chance to do that because it gets real crowded real fast, especially in the last couple of days. So if you hadn't got, if you've texted me and you haven't gotten a response yet, just bear with us. We are literally working around the clock, trying to make sure that everybody gets taken care of. There are so many new students that we're just trying to make sure everybody's got their email, uh, their login and all of that good stuff. So happy birthday. Um, I hope you had an amazing birthday and yeah, I'm super duper duper excited for what's to come for your future. All right. How do I get in contact with support? OK, so the best way to get in, I think there's going to be a link that is dropped here in just a second or a, a screenshot of it. Um, the way to get in touch with support is marquettabrothers.com slash support is really that simple. All right. Marquettabrothers.com slash support. All right, <clears throat> moving right along to the next question. All right, um, here, I will choose it because 
I saw one earlier that, oh, here we go. JOK. JOK says, when does the Lace Wig University begin? So that's a really good question. So the start date for Lace Wig University was November 11th. All right. That was the day that the Lace Wig training system opened up. Well, it was, it's open when you enroll, it's already open. So some people got a head start, but the official start date is November 11th. Now, somebody asked me, will you push back the, uh, will you push back the dates of everything since you extended it? And the answer is no. However, you still, that still gives you plenty of time to go through probably twice and watch all of the videos and start practicing. All right. You still have plenty of time. Don't worry about it. And if you fall behind, it's okay. All right. It's not going to swing a pendulum. I like to keep everybody at the same pace and going together, but I understand that life happens. You have lifetime access to these videos. All right. I don't, I was just um, online the other day and I was looking at an online course for something that I'm, I'm studying, right? And they had the option of paying a, a premium price, a more premium price to have access for 90 days versus only access for 30 days. And to me, I know that as adults and as people, things happen in life and we might may not be able to get to something right away. Something may come up and you have to put something on the back burner and say, I can't do this right now. I need to do something else. And I get it. So for every course that I've ever produced online, it's always been lifetime access. So you don't have to worry about um, falling behind and losing access to the course. You're going to have access for life. All right. All righty. Let me see. Okay. Rhonda says, I would like to know more about understanding the direction of hair growth, Jason's interview, to properly place the hair. So one of the things that I would say to do to really understand hair growth is to study different ethnicities, different people, different types and different textures of hair. And here's what I mean by that. A simple Google search of a hairline can expose so many different things to you. Just um, this was probably about a year and a half ago. I walked into I've been going to the same shout out to shout out to my nail tech, Steph. Y'all can't see my nails, but I mean, she nail she nails it every single time. Right. Y'all can't see them, but they have like this marble effect. They look really amazing. She always keeps my nails looking good. But anyway, so <laughs> I walk into her nail salon and I don't know. I had been going to her already then for like three years and I had never noticed her hairline probably because she was wearing her hair down. But this particular day she had her hair up and I was like, oh my gosh, she, she was like, why are you staring at my hair? I said, no, I'm looking at your hairline because I've never seen a hairline that is the same density from, from the ear, one ear over here, all the way to the other side. And it was just it was almost like she didn't have a widow's peak and her hair just kind of grows kind of straight across, but like with a little bit of um, a little bit of peaks and valleys, I'll say. And so it was very interesting to me. So I said, please don't get offended by this, but can I please take a picture of your hairline? And so sometimes I will sit on Google and I'll go through and I'll look at different hairlines. Or one day I may go through and look at different cowlicks or whorls or uh, whirls in a beard and study how hair grows because the whole idea behind making a wig, I've said this before, I will always say this, is making it look as realistic as possible. And so with that, you have to be able to mimic the behavior and growth pattern of natural hair. That's why some people uh, do two-way ventilating, ventilating in multiple directions within the same hexagon. All right. So doing things like that, cross knotting, reverse cross knotting, um, utilizing split knots when they wouldn't normally be utilized, understanding the rules first, and then breaking the rules to create movement and to create shape and to trick the eye and throw off the eye. That's where the creativity lies in ventilating 
in, and lies in wig making. That's what makes it so amazing is that you're only limited to your creativity. All right. Whew, I like that question. Um, <laughs> this is another common question that we get a lot. I purchased a kit. When am I going to get my kit? All right. All the toolkits are shipping. Some of them have already shipped. All right. Some of the toolkits are already gone and the rest of them are shipping in phases. <clears throat> but you should receive an email here within the next 24 to 48 hours with your tracking number and it'll be tracked all the way to your door. What happened with the toolkits is that we had an item that was on back order that was supposed to come in that didn't come in on time. And we can blame, of course, COVID for that, which is, that's what we were told. All right. So rest assured, we got everything and we are getting everything ready to ship out. You should be receiving an email uh, with your tracking number. All right. It's taking just a bit longer than we anticipated, but do not worry. You will get it. You will have it. You'll be able to practice. All right. Everything's going to be all good. Okay. Um, let me see. Where did I leave off at? Oh, don't forget. <laughs> don't forget the Midwest. My husband is from the Midwest. He's from Oklahoma City. So I promise you, I won't forget the Midwest. All right. We lived in uh, Austin, Texas for a little while before moving out here to Vegas. So when we um, first bought our home here in Las Vegas, we sold our home, I think, November 30th. And for the entire month of December, we took a 30 day road trip and drove all the way cross country out here to Vegas. So we went to go visit my family in North Carolina. Then we went down to Texas and all, all the way up and through until we got to Vegas. So we were in Austin for a little bit. I actually like Austin. Um, it was really, really nice there. And I have considered, we have considered potentially leaving Vegas and moving to Texas. But I don't know if I could do that. I just had some family. Um, I just had lunch with some family that came in for vacation earlier today. And they were asking me if I, how much I like it here. I love it here. And I think it's the mountains and it's the dry air because back East is so moist. I wouldn't be able to wear my, uh, yeah, see, I'm trying to, make my curls pop, but I wouldn't be able to wear my natural hair back home. It would, I would just, it would just not work out. So, um, I like it here, but the Midwest has a special place in my heart. All right. Um, okay. Moving right along. Did you, oh, oh, okay. I, I missed that. I thought you said Marquetta. Did you get the bamboo needles? I was about to say, so to get those, you want to go to at Leerbasi.com. Oh, look at that. Kulada says, I can single knot now. Boop. Yes. Doesn't it feel, you feel so accomplished when you can nail something as simple as the single knot because the single knot is the foundation for everything that you're going to do with ventilating. So you've got to get that single knot down. So that's awesome. Um, all right. Moving right along. Okay, Brenda says, Brenda Jameson says, hi, Marquetta. I would like to know how the info on studying on making a lace wig and all digital online is something, is it, oh, is it online or something that we get in the mail? It's all online. You don't get anything pertaining to the, uh, the Lace Wig University in the mail unless you order the starter toolkit. All right. Everything is online. It's already recorded. It is available. The Lace Week training system is the first thing that's going to be available for you to watch. And then uh, once we get into the mentorship program, everything will drip from there. All right. It's video filmed in filmed in 4K, uh, high definition, but not just that. We have closed captions for those of you who need closed captions. And uh, we've got some really good camera angles, great lenses. You don't have to worry about, man, why can't she move her shoulder? I can't see past her fingers because there are times where we have uh, two, one camera 
shooting on the, the wig block and then one literally over my shoulder. So it feels like you're standing over my shoulders watching me ventilate. It was very important for me to get these certain camera angles so that you can really put yourself in, like put yourself where I am and picture yourself ventilating with, with your hands the way my hands are. All right, that was really important to me. Okay, whoo, this is amazing. Um, all right, I'm still looking for questions. Um, I went all the way back to the beginning. Uh -huh. Hello from South Carolina, ready for this adventure. Listen, we lived in South Carolina for 10 years in Somerville. Very close to Charleston. Well, you probably know that. Um, hello, hello. I'm glad <laughs> you all got me straight. I've been there. All right. That's amazing. Oh, okay, good. Okay, good. Now I know. I was like, why you got this? You're talking about your text. Yes, good. I'm so glad. That's right. You got this. Oh, uh, AJ. Thank you so much. Listen, I get excited every time I get to go live. Mm. My um, throat doesn't, though, because my throat gets dry. Okay, here we go. I'm looking back at my piece with fresh, somewhat rested eyes. Let me stop there for a second. It's very, very, very important to give your eyes a break throughout this process. All right. You don't want to sit there and stare at your wig block for hours without taking a break. Um, my active release Cairo told me every 45 minutes I needed to get up and stretch. One of the stretches he had me do, I'm going to scoop my chair over so I can show you, was he called it, oh, I forgot what he called it. Something about a needle, like a, a needle and thread. He might have called it threading, but you can't see my hand here. I'll scoot over. He had me put my ear to my shoulder. And then when I come up, bend my wrist just like this, and then move my head over just like this. It gives you a, dip, a different type of stretch throughout this area right here, especially if you have carpal tunnel. Um, and it really, really helps to stretch things out. And then of course, um, if you could bend over and touch your toes, touch your toes, just stretch your back, get up and move around, rotate your wrist. This is another good one. Pushing it forward and then pulling back on those fingers to stretch this whole area here. Just doing little things like that help considerably. All right. So typically I go for 45 minutes, then I look up and, and, and sometimes get up and stretch and then go back in. And I will set timers because if not, I'll just go and be feeling like I'm stuck like this for, <laughs> for a long time. Okay. I think I'm cross nodding correctly. Perfect. So looking back at my piece with fresh, somewhat rested eyes, I think I'm cross nodding correctly. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Um, okay. Moving right along. Oh, Terry, so glad you will be bringing the program back next year. Yes, I will. Um, I just don't have any dates yet. But listen, for those of you who already know, you see that link right there, lacewiguniversity.com. But as soon as I, uh, there it is. That's everything right there that you get. I'm so excited for this program because it's just awesome. I just put everything together in one, the mentorship program, the bonuses, the laser training system, the lives, the, the website seal, the certificate and everything. All right. And it ends at midnight and this is it. I did extend it for about a week, but after the, after tonight, that's it. There's no more extensions. Um, it will be sometime next year when it relaunches. And I always say, when you take it, it is the right time for you to take it. And everybody that has enrolled has been very excited, just like I am, and happy to get started. All right. Uh, okay, let's see. Felisa says, Felisa says, I enrolled in the class but didn't apply the email. How can I get into, get in, 
into contact with support. Oh, marquettabarson.com slash support. All right, marquettabarson.com slash support. Stephanie. <laughs> Can I borrow a cradle until, I don't know. <laughs> oh, man. Okay. Every time somebody talks about the cradle, I'm going to play the video for the cradle. Y'all want to see the video for the cradle again? Drop a thumbs up in the chat. <laughs> Y'all are hilarious. Hilarious. <laughs> All right. Um, let's see. Now, <laughs> look, yes. <laughs> yes. <laughs> oh, man. Show that walnut wood for him. <laughs> All right, we got thumbs up. Let's do it. Y'all's comments <laughs> are hilarious. This one was my favorite one. Stephanie said, this is better than a car commercial to me. So listen, here's what I'm going to do. To honor the last day of the launch, I'm going to give another one away tonight. I had not planned on doing this, but y'all ask about this thing every time I get on here. So I don't know, I don't know how, I don't know what the criteria is going to be just yet. I'll figure that out at the end. So I'm going to give one of these away at the end. It is the Ezra wig cradle that has not yet been released. Um, it was everything that you just saw come up on your screen. So I'm going to give one away tonight. So I don't know how I'm going to do that yet, but, uh, Share this live with your, uh, share this live with anybody who wants to learn the amazing art of making lace wigs and ventilating. Okay. I'm going right back to the comments. Listen, I really, really, really um, appreciate y'all sharing and commenting. If you don't know, the reason why people, when they get on live, it, 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 the reason why they ask you to like and share is because that helps the algorithm put their information or put their videos in front of more people so that they can inspire more people. So that's why we always ask that it helps the algorithm on these platforms to say, hey, this is popular. Let's show it to more people so that they can get their message out to more people. And then this is the thing, too. This is a marketing, um, uh, a marketing note that you want to write down. You have to have some sort of, that is called a call to action, all right? A call to action. I am saying exactly what I would like for you to do, right? Like and share. If you don't give your people or if you don't give people a call to action, no action will be taken because you can't assume that people know 
to like and share. You can't assume they're going to remember. So you, if you're going to be going live or doing anything like that, always have some sort of call to action. All right. So in about 20 minutes, I am going to actually, no, it's not going to be in about 20 minutes. It's going to be in about 25 to 30 minutes. I'm going to be giving an Ezra wig cradle away. I had not planned on doing that, uh, but I'm going to do it tonight. And I don't even know how I'm going to do it yet. I don't know if I'm going to ask a question or if I'm just going to randomly select somebody in the comments. In fact, that's what I'm going to do. Um, make sure if you're watching and you're interested in winning, winning, and you're interested in, 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 in getting or winning. Yeah, that's a good word. This tonight, comment in the chat. I want the cradle. All right. That's how we'll know you're interested. And my producer will randomly select, select, <laughs> oh my gosh. We'll randomly pick someone and we will uh, we'll get your information and ship it out. Again, drop in the chat. I want the cradle. All right. I'm celebrating tonight the final night of Lace Wig University being open for enrollment it ends tonight at midnight. And you guys have gone so hard for this cradle that I'm going to give another one away. I had not planned to do this and in fact i'm gonna give you this one right here this is the one this is the one that i use but i'm gonna give you mine all right i'm gonna give you my cradle okay going back to the comment oh dang everybody wants the cradle <laughs> everybody wants the cradle oh man y'all are so awesome y'all are so so awesome okay <laughs> I really, really, really want the cradle. Y'all are so awesome. Okay, let me go back to um, let me go back to your questions. Um, this is amazing. I, I'm guessing you mean started working on my first closure. That's amazing. You're ahead of the game. Um, let's see. Oh man. Everybody wants the cradle. <laughs> well, I can't even get to the other questions. Okay. Oh, yes, Paige. These, the camera angles on the ventilation module are everything because I needed it for the single knot. You can thank uh, my amazing husband for those angles because in full transparency, see, I'm giving y'all some behind the scenes tea. In full transparency, we have filmed the entire ventilating module. I want to show y'all something. We filmed the entire ventilating module while I was, uh, at first, while I was sitting here with this cradle. And instead of the, the second angle being behind me, it was just here on this, uh, on the wig block from here. And then I had this camera here. And Mr. Breslin said, that's not good enough. I need, I want them to be able to see over your shoulder. And I said, yeah, you're right. So we filmed the whole thing, took hours for us to film the whole thing, only for us to say, nah, this needs to be even better. And then once we got the camera angles good, we started switching different lenses. So here's a lens here that we tried. Then we tried this one. Then we tried this one. Then we tried this one. And then we even tried the pancake lens. And I don't remember which one we ended on, but you see it in the modules. It looks really amazing. When I tell you we really put our all into this, that was not the only thing that we refilmed too. There was something else that I said, nope, I don't like it. We're going to start all over. And my husband looked at me like, you're not, you're not serious. I said, no, I'm dead serious. I don't want it to look like this. I want it to look like that. And that means I'm going to have to start all over from scratch. So it wasn't like I just sat down and filmed everything and was like, oh, we're done. I'm, that's fine. If I mess up here or, or, or make a mistake and say something here or do something there. No, I went back and I re-recorded everything that I didn't like. All right. So 
I'm happy and excited for the end result. Okay. So yes, the camera angles were everything. This is just one, two, three, four, five, six. We have seven different lenses that we use for different purposes. And then of course, on the first night that I went live, you saw my new apparatus for ventilating that I haven't even really gotten to show you in detail yet. So over the next um, couple of months, as we'll be going live doing different things with wigs, I'll get to show you it in depth even more the um, custom apparatus. I'm just gonna call it apparatus. The custom apparatus thing that I had made for zooming in when ventilating. And I just purchased a very specific cable that can hook up to the, what do you call it? The machine, I'll say, that we use to go live to be able to switch camera angles so that you can see from the huge zoomed in thing that I'm ventilating with. So you don't, you're not going to miss anything. All right. It's going to be the quality and production is going to be up another notch. It's going to be amazing. Okay. Brittany says, yes, the production quality exceeded what I ever could have imagined. Thank you. You are so welcome. My husband is a man that operates in excellence. And so do I. And he was not playing when it came. In fact, I think one or two of these lenses we ordered specifically for filming Lacewig University. Um, so really, really we, we take that seriously. Uh, AJ says Lacewig University is amazing. If someone's still not enrolled, you need to. This is amazing. Thank you so much. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. I love that shirt. I have to say, right? I love Target. Target, Target. So I went to Target the other day and I got like five t-shirts. You know, my favorite one though, this, I mean, this is my favorite one. My second favorite one is Princess Tiana. I love that t-shirt. I love that t-shirt. So I'll wear that one day next week. Um, okay. Back to your questions. Take a leap, y'all. Stop playing with your future. I know that's right. Wait until the most, <laughs> the most, one of the most mind things that's going to blow your mind. The wig making part is amazing. The bonuses are amazing. All right. But when you get to marketing and mindset, it's going to completely blow your mind. All right. Um, I am one of those people who I don't believe in holding any information back when it comes to anything that I do. People even think I'm crazy. I'm just moving these lenses, y'all, out of the way because some of them are pretty expensive and I don't want to hit anything. And then we have to replace a lens. All right. <clears throat> so I forgot what I was saying, but um, I'll get back to it in a minute. Oh, marketing. Marketing and uh, having the right mindset. We've been... Some some people think because they just find me that I just started doing this, but I've actually, my husband and I have been in business going on 19 years now. And we started in business all the way back in 2003 when there was no YouTube, no uh, anything really, not, not like what we have now. Uh, there was barely Google. <laughs> it used to be Yahoo or, or, uh, Microsoft or something like that. It wasn't even what we have now. So we didn't have anybody to teach us anything. We had to learn everything through trial and error. And we made money, but we lost money. And the whole point to that marketing section is to, to make it so that you don't have to go through what we went through. All right, I streamlined the entire process. Oh, yes, you are in Brenda Johnson. Congratulations. Wait, Brenda Jameson. See, I need my glasses, okay? Charge it, to, charge it to my head, not my heart. I am looking all the way here and I'm not wearing my glasses because my lashes and glasses don't mix. So, Brenda Jameson, congratulations. I'm so sorry. Congratulations. I'm so excited and happy that you are in. All right. I saw a question about Galoon. Where did it go? Um, 
Oh, oh, thank you so much. Yes, you got this. See, when I put this t-shirt on, I knew it would be perfect for the occasion. You got this. So somebody, I saw a comment about somebody asking for um, where to get the galoon from. You can order the galoon from Yagazi Naturals. You can order it from the wig department and you can order it from Atelier Bossy. All right. One of those three places will have it. You might be able to find it at his and her. Um, but I'm not too sure. I know those first three places that I named and Fishbach Miller, uh, one of those three places will be able to get you all taken care of. Okay. Let me go back over here to some of these questions. Thank you so much. I appreciate you. I appreciate you. So look, I saw some people just join in on the chat, you are tuned into Marquetta Breslin Live. And tonight I am taking your questions about ventilating. So if you have any questions about ventilating, the process of ventilating, uh, anything related to ventilating, drop those questions in the chat. And then also I am celebrating the last day to enroll right here a lace wig university where you can learn how to make wigs closures and frontals from scratch you'll also learn how to market your services as well as having the right mindset all right i also flew in instructors from all over the world to teach you different things about the wonderful world of wig making and i'm super excited to be releasing my brand new bonus called Sewing Machine Wigs Make Easy, where I teach you how to make a wig on a sewing machine using four different types of machines, three traditional machines, but three different types of traditional machines and the industrial machine as well. So I'm very, very, very excited. Enroll right here at lacewiguniversity.com. Just look over in the comments. You will not be disappointed, okay? So going back to taking your questions. <laughs> Oh, <laughs> I know I'm extra late, but I appreciate your ad through not Carlton Banks. Listen, I love his videos because the characters are so real. Everybody can relate to at least three of the characters that uh, he does those skits with. So it's really funny. Um, and Cheerlebrity. So I discovered him um, on Instagram. The, a few years back when no it was actually on facebook i came across one of the videos that he did about easter when i tell you i was laughing so hard i was crying and then he did the one about bonnets and uh poof be gone your makeup too strong all of that so he's actually done a cheer for me before for the lace week training system and i reached out to him again and he nailed it all right. It was so, 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 so good. I am so, uh, I was so happy with both, both of them, both of them. All right. Oh, Zinnia. I hope I'm saying your name right from Texas. Welcome to Lacewick University. Charles from North Carolina. Welcome. Uh, uh, let's see. These are the people who just ordered and they're coming in super fast. Uh, Jane from Tennessee. Dequarsha from Texas, Tavaria from Alabama. Shout out to all of you. And I'm super excited that you have just enrolled. Jessica from Indiana. Wow, y'all are amazing. And they're still coming in. Shavela from Michigan. Uh, they're still coming in. Mona from Ohio. Man. They're coming in really, really fast. Jay Moore from Georgia. Congratulations. I'm super excited. Welcome to the family. Tan Farah from California. Woo, y'all are not playing tonight. Shinika. Shin <laughs> wait, wait. <laughs> this is an inside joke. Shinika, I know you are laughing right now. Okay, let me tell y'all the inside joke. Jess, if you're watching, I love you but I love to tell this joke. So Shanika, I hope this is, I hope this is you Shanika. So 
Shanika has graduated from my business mentorship program. Shout out to Genevieve too from the UK. So Shanika has graduated from my business mentorship program. At the end of that program, you come back here to Vegas with me for five days of some of the most intense training for your personal life as well as for your business. So as people come in, they go through the registration table. And for some reason, I kept, I saw her walk in and I kept hearing Shinika, Shinika. And I was like, who the heck is Shinika? And I kept looking, I said, Jess, who's Shinika? I know everybody in here, but I don't know who Shinika is. And she said, Shinika. And she pointed to her, I said, Shanika, not Shinika, Shanika. And when I tell you, we laughed so hard, we cried. I was crying. I was laughing so hard. You might not be laughing right now, but every time I see her name, I mistake and say Shinika when it's Shinika. Okay, just a joke. All right, we have even more people that have just joined. So I already gave a shout out to Genevieve from the UK, Aisha from Jersey. Hey, from Jersey, I have family in Jersey. Latoya from North Carolina, Trishana from Canada. Uh, thank you so much for joining Lacewig University and Nedra from Georgia. Y'all are amazing. Rhonda from North Carolina. Y'all know I'm from North Carolina originally. Angela from uh, LA. What's up? Oh my goodness. Uh, Chatilia from Charles Charlotte <laughs> from Charlotte, North Carolina. Uh, <clears throat> The way they're coming in, y'all, is the way I'm reading them, okay? Veronica from St. Louis, man, wow. Y'all are just amazing. And I see these comments coming in. I hope y'all were laughing with me <clears throat> and not at me because, man, that was funny. I mean, at least I thought it was funny. <laughs> uh, okay, let's see. Yes, Nina, point nodding. So point nodding... <clears throat> Oh, perfect scenario. So I actually think that she shares this inside uh, the bonuses for Lace Wig uh, for the phase three. Um, one of your instructors inside Lace Wig University, Gemma Dillon, uh, used to work. Well, she still does. I think she still does work in television and film. And she made a wig for the character Cersei, they say Cersei, but I say Cersei on Game of Thrones. If you remember, spoiler alert, so if you're watching it, mute me for the next minute. If you remember on Game of Thrones, uh, there's a point in the show where Cersei has to cut her hair and do the Walk of Atonement. And when she cut her hair, it was super duper short and choppy. Gemma, your instructor that's going to be in one of the bonuses in Lacewood University made that wig and she point nodded the entire thing. So the whole idea behind point nodding is to use the instead of if I were to if I were to cut my hair. Right. And I cut my hair at the root just like this. Normally, you would ventilate from with the hair from the root and then this would be what's sticking out. Well, with point knotting, you turn it upside down and you ventilate the points, the ends of the hair, and not the roots. And the reason why they do that is because it creates more movement and it's typically only done for short pixie wigs. All right. Great question, Nina. Thank you for that. Uh, real quick, in just a few minutes, uh, I want to make sure that you remember that we're giving away. Y'all know I'm reading notes at the same time I'm <laughs> doing this. I'm giving away this cradle. So make sure if you're interested, you put I want that cradle in the comments. All right. Don't forget that. Okay. Oh, we got some more new students. Welcome. Joy from Sacramento, California. Brenda from Ridgewood, New York. Man, you guys are inside Lacewig University and I am so so excited for each and every one of you. Y'all are just amazing. Can you see my excitement? Like I'm really, truly excited. Uh, for those of you who are in Lacewood University, let me say this real fast while I have your attention. Um, make sure 
Make sure you pay attention to the live details portion of your member area because I've already added an unannounced live that I'm going to be doing on December 11th to welcome you into your next phase. That was not planned. It's just something that I decided to do. And I'm going to be doing little things like that throughout the duration of your class and your time together. So make sure you're always looking at the live event details portion inside the member area, because that's when I'll be adding uh, little things here and there for going for doing our private live virtual events. OK, back to the live. All right. Let me see what other question I can find in here. You are so welcome, Nina. Um, all right. Brittany, this is a great question. Denier means the weight of the lace. Denier equals weight. How heavy or light the denier is. The lighter, the, the, the lesser the number, like 10, 15, 20, that's going to be your film and HD lace. That's your lighter denier. And then your 20... 5 ish 25 30 and up is going to be your heavier denier that's going to be your base lace your opera lace um and things that will not be visible to the naked eye all right um all right guys you said ah okay you said about lights from Draycast lighting please which one is okay for the beginning as I saw them and the prices are quite different. Let me see, I'm gonna jump over to the website and I'm gonna share my screen with you in just a second. And I will show you which one is a good one for you to start with. So they have these light kits um, and see, a lot of this has changed already. So I'll give you an example of something that would be, see, here's one right here. Let me share my screen with you. Okay, share screen. So I can show you. Now this one right here, as soon as it pops up, boom, there it is. Okay, this one right here is perfect. Um, it's inexpensive. It was only $79. And I believe it comes with, it is the Draycast X Series LED 240 by color on camera. So actually, that light is designed to go on top of a camera. But even though it's designed to go on top of a camera, they nine times out of 10, they can come with a small tripod or even a big tripod. They're like $14 so that you can still mount it to um, a tripod for a light. So it's a lighting stand. I call it a tripod because it still has three legs, but it's a lighting stand. So the lighting stands typically have one long pole and then three legs at the bottom. Those are around 14 bucks and you can buy them with these lights. Some of the lights come with it. All right. Okay, so instead of having uh, my producer to pick a winner, I actually asked Jessica to pick a winner randomly from everybody who put, I want the cradle. All right, so here we go. What time is it? Let me see if it's time yet for me. All right, we got about two minutes, so I think it's time. Okay, here we go. Who is going to win this cradle? All right, where's my phone? I got to check my text messages to see who she sent me. Oh, man, this is so exciting. All right. Here we go. <laughs> and the winner is <clears throat> drum roll. Rhonda Thornton. Rhonda, congratulations. I'm so excited. Woo. I'm so excited for you. Here's what I need you to do. Send an email to support at marquettabreslin.com. Everybody congratulate Rhonda. Yes. Send an email to support at marquettabreslin.com in the subject. Um, just put winner. In parentheses, you can put wig cradle. And make sure to include 
your mailing address so we can get it shipped right to you. Okay, man, that was exciting. I'm so excited. All right, listen, guys, let me remind you. Um, this is number one. I got a couple of reminders. All right. <clears throat> this is the last day, the last night, the last few hours that you can enroll in Lace Wig University. Everything that you see on the screen is everything you get when you enroll uh, tonight. You're going to get instant access into uh, the Lace Wig training system, which is right here. 16 modules taught by yours truly to teach you everything from the history to the tools to uh, ventilating to making of closure, making a frontal, making a full lace wig, doing repairs, all kinds of things. It is absolutely amazing. Your second phase is going to unlock December 11th. All right. In that phase, you're going to make we're going to make your first piece together. Then you're going to learn how to market your services and have the right mindset. In the middle of all of that, we have a private mentorship meeting. All right. In that mentorship meeting, you will have the opportunity. There's going to be a form that you will have access to prior to this that you will have filled out with all of your questions. I will answer those questions on that live mentorship meeting, however long it takes. OK, after that, then that is when the bonuses unlock. Um, those bonuses are absolutely amazing. This is phase three. I flew in instructors from all over the world, from London to Alabama to um, Atlanta to you name it, from everywhere. All right. You're going to learn so many different things. And I'm so excited about my brand new bonus, Sewing so Machine Wigs Made Easy, where I'm going to teach you how to make a wig on four different sewing machines, three of them traditional, one of them industrial it's going to be amazing. Super excited for that. And then we're going to have a graduation party and all of your graduation assets are going to unlock, including your certificate. You'll have to take your test and pass it. Once you do that, then you'll be able to download your certificate and download the code for the seal on your website to let everybody know that you are a graduate of Lacewig University. All you got to do is go right here to lacewiguniversity.com to enroll. There's only a few hours left and then it's gone. It is the last night you can enroll. Congratulations to everyone who has already enrolled. I'm super duper excited. This is the last night until sometime next year. I don't have any dates for that as of yet. Now, as for these lives, I enjoy doing these lives. However, I need a little bit of a break. So for the next week, so next week I won't be live, but there will be interviews that will be dropping. These will be the interviews that uh, happened during the Wigathon. So if you weren't at the Wigathon, you want to tune into these lives because they're, I mean, to the uh, interviews because they're going to be amazing and they're very, very, very inspiring. On Monday, though, I will still be live on Monday doing the Monday prayer. All right. So Monday morning at 9 a.m. Pacific Standard Time, I'm going to be right there doing prayer. If you have a prayer request, you can go to myquitterbrazen.com slash ministry. That comes directly to me. Nobody else sees it. Or you can just text that number that's scrolling down below if you want. Now, if you text that number, you text a prayer request that's private. Other people might see it. But if you go to marquetterbrenson.com slash ministry, only I see it. All right. Thank you guys so much for hanging out with me. Ooh, excuse me. I pray that you have an amazing Thanksgiving. Enjoy the rest of your week. I love each and every one of you. Again, thank you so much to everyone who joined and enrolled in Lace Week University. I'm so excited. We're going to have an amazing time together. Remember, you got this. All right. Remember, write this down. I've got this. No matter what things look like, you got it. You can do this. All right. Sometimes the road is not going to be easy. But the thing that I never want you to do is give up. All right. Keep pressing forward. Keep moving forward. You can do this. I know you can. You're going to be amazing at it. And you're going to come out on the other side of this thing and build an amazing wig business and service people from all over the world and change your family tree. That's right. I said it. 
All right. Never forget that that was said and spoken over your life. I love each and every one of you. God bless you. Have an amazing Thanksgiving and weekend. And I'll see you the first. Uh, well, I'll see you on Monday for the prayer call. All right. Take care. I love you and good night.